canoeing, kayaking, whatever you want to call it, just like pretty much any other sport, is about sequencing. It's not about what it looks like from the side. We all watch kayaking from the side. It's a crap place to watch kayaking from. <clears throat> it's about sequencing. So if you were to do a throw, if I'm going to throw something through that door, set me up. What's the, what's the first thing I do? Look at it. Just look at it. Turn sideways. I'm going to go sideways. I'm going to throw through there. Then what? Then I'll load my back leg. Because where's the power going to come from from the throw? It comes from the neck. The power is coming from the leg. I set my arm up in this position. Does that look familiar at all? Okay. All sports are the same. We set up in this position, we've got the leg bent like that, we've got the arm bent like that, and what happens? I start with my leg. What's my arm done? Nothing. Then my hip joins in. What's my arm done? Then my waist joins in. Then my elbow, and then my wrist, and my fingers. So I start with power, which is slow. Okay? If I... I'm going to just slow it down. If I let go of this, having done the power bit, it's none too impressive. Equally, you're up. <laughs> Have we got a little fluffy ball or something? Just a bit of paper. Doing a bit of paper. Like over the touch. Yeah, go for it. Okay, it's a bit unfair. I might pick the wrong person, but there are two types of throws. <laughs> <laughs> there are boys throws, and there are other throws. Do you want me to do a girl's throw? I'd, I'd, like, to, I'd like to just see you throw it. Like, like, do you want me to try properly, or do you want me to, to just... Do whatever you want. Do it properly, like a girl. There you go. Not too bad. <laughs> <laughs> it's alright, it's alright. But you're not going to generate much power once this is off the floor. This must stay on the floor throughout. But must stay on the footrest throughout. So, it's very different. That essentially, you've lost the power halfway through and you just use the speed. Okay? Speed without power is rubbish. That's the negative angle on there. So, for throwing, power, power. Speed. Okay. In that order. This is exactly the same. <laughs> so here we generate power. Power, power. Now we've got the boat moving. There's probably zero resistance at this stage to the boat moving. We generate the power and then we generate the speed. We can only use the fast muscles or the small muscles for the speed bit. If we use the speed at the front, it's done. If you do a deadlift, exactly the same. Golf swing, exactly the same. Deadlift, if you try to do this bit first, before you do this bit, it won't go very far. You have to get the thing moving and use the biggest muscles, the smaller ones, the smaller ones, the smaller ones, the smallest ones. Okay, because the smaller the muscle, the faster it will move. <clears throat> so it's all about sequencing. You cannot break the sequence, nor can you override the sequence and use your fast ones first just because you're in a hurry. You have to be patient.